A true standout on the diamond, Steve Condotta is one of the most decorated student-athletes in Florida Tech baseball history. Condotta came to Melbourne from Mississauga, Ontario, and played four seasons for the Panthers from 2004 until 2007. During his four-year career, he became one of the best shortstops to ever don the crimson and gray. As a freshman in 2004, Kadada started 40 games and racked up 49 hits, 30 runs, 6 doubles, and 12 runs batted in. He also successfully swiped 11 bags in 14 attempts. Kadada started 55 games as a sophomore and was named to the All-Sunshine State Conference second team after recording 66 hits, a team-high 49 runs, 13 doubles, 20 runs batted in, and 16 steals that season. The following year in 2006, Kadada started 42 games and batted 377 with the team best 61 hits, 46 runs, 29 runs batted in, 12 doubles, 3 triples, and 4 home runs. Also a standout in the classroom, the junior was recognized as Florida Tech's Baseball Scholar Athlete of the Year in 2006. In his final season at Florida Tech, Kadada was named National Collegiate Baseball Writers Association All-America First Team. He was also chosen third team All-America that same season by the American Baseball Coaches Association and Dectronics. Academically, he was selected Florida Tech's Male Scholar Athlete of the Year in 2007. During the accolades, he started 50 games as a senior while batting 431 and leading the Panthers with 81 hits, 50 runs, and a slugging percentage of 574. Kadada also finished with 31 runs batted in, 11 doubles, two triples, and two home runs. His 42 stolen bases ranked sixth in NCAA Division II. At the end of his four-year career and 187 games, Kadada batted 355 with 257 hits, 42 doubles, five triples, eight home runs, and 111 runs batted in. He currently holds the program's career record for runs scored at 175, hits at 257, stolen bases at 76, and total at bats at 723. In the classroom, he earned recognition on the Dean's List all eight semesters and was named to the Sunshine State Conference Commissioner's Honor Roll all four years. Following his four-year Panther career, Kadada was selected with the 385th overall pick by the Toronto Blue Jays in the 12th round of the 2007 Major League Baseball Draft. Welcome to the Florida Tech Sports Hall of Fame, Steve Kandata. Uh, my name is Greg Berkmeyer. I'm the head baseball coach here at Florida Tech. Uh, I've been here for 14 years and uh, I spent five years as the assistant. I was the recruiting coordinator when Steve Kandata was, was a part of our program. Uh, spent Since then, and spent the not, last nine years as the head baseball coach here. Steve was a tremendous, tremendous asset to our program. He was a hard worker. He's probably one of the hardest workers that we've ever had here in program. You know, he was just a tremendous asset. He, he really exemplified everything that we were trying to get accomplished here. And, you know, just the way that he went about his business, the way that he got himself prepared on a daily basis was just tremendous. And it was one of those things where we're just so very, very fortunate of having him be a part of our program. Well, Steve was, like I said, he was a tremendous worker. He was somebody that, he was one of the first guys at the field. He was one of the last guys to leave every single day. Everything that he did, he, he made sure he did it with passion and got himself ready, ready to play on a daily basis. Uh, he was a kid that, you know, he was a five-tool player. He could beat you in so many ways. He could be a guy that could, that could steal a base for you, bunt, get on that way, uh, hit a line drive, hit the ball out of the ballpark. He could beat you with his glove, beat you with his running tool. You know, he did just so many things to, to help our team win. Well, I mean, he, was a, he was a great, great student athlete. Uh, he was such a tremendous worker both on and off the field. Uh, he did just a tremendous job in the classroom as well. And, you know, he was somebody that we knew was going to be successful when he got here and, and knew that he was going to be successful in life when he left. Just the way that he went about everything was just something that, you know, we're trying to continue to get guys that are going to be that type of pro person and, and uh, you know he did just a tremendous job while he was here and showed what you're supposed to do when you're a student athlete. Well when I think about Steve the first thing that comes to mind is our game against Tampa back in 2007. Uh, Steve you know he was dealing with some injuries there throughout that year and and he went out there that day and he went five for five. He had four bunt hits and, and was able to slash a single through the through the infield as well and we come to find out about a week later that he actually was playing with two broken hands. Uh, you know and that just goes to show you know what type of competitor Steve was and the way that he went about his business and, and how important winning was to 
him and you know he was a guy that just really showed by example what it meant to be a to to be a good baseball player and to be a good student athlete well, I'd like to uh, first of all say congratulations to Steve on, on this tremendous accomplishment and all the other Hall of Famers that are being inducted this year. Uh, it's, it's a tremendous accomplishment by all of you and I uh, just want to wish you guys the best of luck and, and congratulations once again.